I'm going to do an overview of blocking in the FreeBSD kernel. Now you might wonder what inspired me to come up with such an exciting title at 8, 10 o'clock in the morning. Uh, and the answer is that uh, slowly but surely, uh, George Neville Deal and I, along with Robert Watson, are working on a new edition of the design and implementation of the FreeBSD book. <laughs> and as part of that, um, George gets to do things like the networking, and uh, Robert gets to do the security, and I get to do fun things like, oh, locking. <laughs> <laughs> so I spent the better part of two weeks going through all the locking to try and understand why we needed eight different ways of doing locking. And I figured if I had suffered through all that, I could just put it down so you only have to suffer through it for about an hour to get the same amount of information. Uh, well. <laughs> I have to suffer through it to write the locking man page. <coughs> you should just ask her. <laughs> okay, so what are we going to do? Well, just for grins and giggles, I figured I would do a walkthrough of the way we historically used to do synchronization. That would be sort of back in the days of the, the uh, non-SMP kernel. Just to sort of show you how far we've come. Uh, I'll then talk about the locked hierarchy, that list of all the different ones. So I'll have all the different kinds of locks on one page, which I'll then uh, be essentially spending most of my time talking about here in the details. Uh, the management of locks now uses two different sets of data structures, things called turn styles and a thing called sleep queues, which are for the two main classes of locks. So I'm going to talk about those data structures because in some sense, if you understand the what's going on behind the curtain, it makes it easier to understand the actual locks themselves. And then at the end, to the extent I have time, we'll talk about the witness system, which is the way you keep these things from getting all tied up in knots. Okay, so historic synchronization. 